Yo, what up, gamers? I just want to do the fiery Frank Odin skin, I'll be honest with you. I have no plan of attack for this Odin game. Uh, but I'm sure we can figure something out. In my head, I was like, what should I do that people would want to click on? And there was like, you know, Chernobog. People don't people don't really see Chernobog games often. You know, Maui's fucking crazy that would be insane if you did that uh, but in the back of my mind it's like hot wieners though you know like that's that's a that's a fiery wiener that's worth it so uh here we are being a fiery wiener uh I, do i get my three here or do i just put two points on my two Technically, my three does the most damage because it pulses three times and then you throw it. So technically, it's more damage to max my three. I'm just going to put one point in everything. You think he's going to invade me? Oh, no. He's not. He's doing a buff because he's got the same gold as me and I already killed the minis. That's how you can tell, by the way, if you're going to get invaded or not. Just watch their gold. If their gold isn't going up at all, they're invading. If their gold went up a little bit, then... Oh, man, he can stop my my glizzy gobbler attack. Damn it. But if their attack... If, they're, if their gold's not going up at all, that means that they uh, are probably going to invade you. But I cannot do that. I don't know what I'm doing. All right. Dang it. Why, why are you that tanky though? All right. All right. I'm just slow clearing this because I want my red buff. All right. We're just going to do one tick of the three because if you do the one, the first tick of the year three does uh, uh, AOE auto attack speed increase in a radius around you. If you do the second tick, it automatically aims in towards whatever enemy god you're looking at. If you do the third tick, it is a stun. And then your shield, if your shield is at full health, <coughs> this is something a lot of people don't actually know about Odin. If you put your shield on and it doesn't take any damage at all, it does additional damage. An additional 15% damage, which is a huge amount of damage when you're late game. So like, Using your shield as, you know, just pure HP is not bad because it's a 340 HP shield. But using it as damage is also completely and utterly viable. Like, it's it's super good. Now, he's going tablet, which is the build I personally do on RTO. It's the best build, in my opinion, actually. You're going to stun me. Dash away. Yep, yep, yep. I just want to make sure that he's not stacking his tablet, basically. Like, I just got to make sure that he's not hitting me with all of these... All of these abilities. That did 57 damage. I'm leveling my 2, I guess, which is r the wrong move. Technically speaking. Alright, the blue is up. Can I get this, though, is the real question. I can't. I have no idea where he is. He's not doing my blue. I guess he just backed. That's weird. 
Oh, I didn't hit the back line. Fuck. There's a lot of XP I'm missing, actually. There's a lot of XP I'm missing. Bummer. That's alright. How many sacks of tablet? Only three? That's fine by me. Oh, my nose, dude. <coughs> oh, God. I apologize about my nose. I'm like so nasally right now. It's just allergies kicking my ass. I haven't taken allergy medicine in a while. And so it's just kind of piling up. I have allergy medicine next to me that I will take after this game. That actually did not do much damage. Only, yeah, only like 260. I guess he does have tier 2 defense already. I'm just going to keep farming my brains out, dude. Nothing to see here. Just a farmer at work. All right, one more wave. This wave right here gives me transcendence. Nice. Please stop. Alright, that's pretty good. Uh I kinda wanna go Soul Eater Genji's. I'm a warrior, so I already have 40% cooldown. Once Genji's is finished. 10% transcendence, 10% passive, 10% soul leader, 10% Genji's. And then, uh, you know, fuck it, dude. Let's just do another bobble game. I've been enjoying the bobble. I've been, I've been bobbling. It's not even here, man. What the fuck? Oh. <clears throat> um, I can do your blue, actually. I can, I can. You gonna let me, though? Oh, man, my one didn't kill. Now that is tragic. nothing I could do there. There's nothing I could do there. That's okay. He's tanky. He got the he got defense and I'm double stacking. You know, so like it makes sense that I'm not able to kill him. It also makes sense that he's not able to kill me either. Like the fights are just Unbelievably long for no reason. Oh, nice. I stopped this one. Oh, no, I didn't. I thought I did. Alright, he's going divine, which is a smart play because of the, you know, soul leader and everything. Just stop his back to annoy him. I'll do it again. I'll keep doing it. You think I won't, but I will.
Uh, I kind of wanted to blink auto attack him just because I think it'd be funny, but I chose not to. I chose not to. This is a 7.2 second cooldown. I could lower that to <coughs> what a six point a six point five second cooldown. I think I can lower that to a six point five second cooldown. And then I can also uh by meditation I don't know I'm sure there's people out there that really hate bobble builds and I'm just spamming them recently on YouTube but this happens sometimes man like serrated edge era that by the way I still think is the best item in the game and I buy every game that I can buy it like I could buy this game but I'm doing the bobble thing uh I just think it's amazing, dude. I don't know. He's going to lower my cooldowns, man. Well, I guess it's a good thing I get 10% extra then. I'm going to lower your cooldowns too. Fuck it. You want to lower mine? I'll lower yours. It's Abyssal Stone, right? Come here. Come here. All right, does this kill? Backline? Oh, it does. Wow. Oh, shit. Um, I feel kind of okay with this, dude. Is that weird? Oh, if that hit, man, if that just fucking hit, dude. If that just hit, dude. All right. I'm doing pretty good, though. Like, oh, he got erosion. That's a smart play, dude. That's actually a really smart play. Lowering my shield and gaining movement speed when all I'm doing is spamming shields. That's actually such a smart play. I'm going to get Abyssal Stone because you made me think about it. No other reason. Uh... And that, that's about that's about the extent of my knowledge. I now I meant to press three, not four, but whatever, it'll work, I guess. I'm still here. He does not have enough power to make tablet worth it. By the way, if you go the power build, I'm sorry. If you go the tablet build, you have to go book of thought as well. If you don't go book of thought, there's no reason to go tablet, and instead you should just go like Chronos Pendant or Paul or um. Bancroft or something. Is his tablet four attacks did 185 and he's got 33 stacks on it right now. Like at 33 stacks, you want four attacks to do at least 250. No, he's missing a significant amount of damage. And that damage like scaling wise is only going to get more and more like the difference between not having book and having book. That difference is only going to get more and more dramatic the higher the scaling goes. 
so I don't know. I don't know. What I do know, though, is that I'm at 50% cooldown with meditation again and a bow, and I'm lowering his cooldowns. Dude, I didn't even need to use my meditation there. And I still could just like I just permanently have a shield on. Even with erosion, dude. Yo, that's actually insane. That's actually insane. I just always have a shield on, and he can't do anything because I'm lowering his cooldowns. I wonder if he notices it, though. Like, I wonder if he's like, man, my cooldowns feel really long right now, or if he's just like, fuck, why is my ability not up yet? You know, like... His Abyssal Stone is not something you see very often in Duel. Or, like, really ever. Actually, I shouldn't say really ever, because I just straight up do not play Conquest. I have not played Conquest at all this split. I think I've played, like, three or four games. That's it. I missed. I missed again. Oh, did I just catch his dash? I think I did. Why are you so fast? Oh, erosion. Right. Right. Movement speed from erosion. I mean, I guess I just do bold even. I don't know if I can, though. Well, like, I know I can, but I don't know if I can fast enough. Stay away. Nice. <laughs> all I did... All I did was ult him away. Just a free fire, dude. Nice. Oh my god. What do you do against that? He just surrendered. He was like, what the fuck? He was like, I hit him 16 times with my three. <laughs> Yo. <coughs> I had 70% cooldown against him. Because I had 50% myself while reducing his by 20%. I had a 70% cooldown swing in my kit. That's ridiculous. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, y'all, peace.